one of our most popular product lines among our customers. It's compact and stylish. It's quite light and very easy to carry. The Pro Port's number of E-Series varies from 2 to 3 with different models. E3 can provide as many as 3 ports. It provides practical and various I.O. ports. It's easy to open by sliding the locking switch to the right. The monitor angle is adjustable to fit the watching angle. Operation Demonstration Press the Patient button and enter a new patient information page. Input the basic patient. The patient ID could be created automatically or manually. Then choose the application and fill in relevant information for exams. Also, we could choose patient directly from the patient list or work list to start the exam. After the patient information collection, we could begin the exam by the first step, choosing an exam mode. Here is the exam mode display. We could choose thyroid, for example. It enters the B mode live scanning image area display in the middle of the monitor and parameter adjustment list below. We could switch the button to adjust or press the button to change the adjustment item and press next to go to the second page of parameters. Now I'll introduce the frequently used parameters of B mode. Include gain, increase or decrease brightness of the image, frequency, higher frequency for higher resolution, lower frequency for better penetration, muse scan, speckle reduction and edge enhancement, gray map, different levels of grayscale brightness, DR, Higher dynamic range for more detail, lower dynamic range for higher contrast, chroma, colorized image, and other frequently used parameter button, such as depth, focus, zoom, also available on the control panel to let you have an easy adjustment. Here we have three ways to zoom your image. Switch the zoom button for read zoom. Press the zoom button for right zoom or press Z for screen zoom. After you get a standard sector with good parameters to fit your need, press freeze to get the previous cine. Move your trackball to choose your perfect frame and also there are relevant parameter displays below. You can still make some adjustment after freeze. After finishing the B mode scanning, you could press CFM button above the central control area to change to color mode scanning. You could also active SR flow by key function to improve the capability of detecting flow signal, especially low velocity. When you enter the live color scanning, the ROI box will appear in the center of image area. You can move the trace ball to change the position and press set besides the track ball to motivate size adjustment of the ROI. When the ROI box turns to imaginary line, move the track ball to adjust the size and press set again to confirm the size. Parameters for color mode are displayed as well. Same way to switch the button to modify. Press PW button to enter PW mode. PW are available on B or color mode. The sample volume appears in the center of the image. Move your trackball to move to the right position, then press set to motivate size adjustment. For the sample volume, and move trackball again to adjust the volume size. Press set again after finish volume adjustment. Then update to activate PW scanning you could still move your trackball to make a little change of position of the sample volume. PW scanning will follow the changes, but if you still want to modify the size of the sample volume, press update again to back to proactive. Besides the parameters list display below, we could still use the baseline scale button to help you modify the image. Don't forget to freeze after you get the PW image you want. If you want to modify your image more easily, just press Auto 
to help you automatically optimize the B color and PW mode. It saves your time for the comprehensive parameter adjustment. Besides examinations above, the E-Series also equipped with practical functions for your efficiency, such as Sonohelp, which could provide you guidance of exam. Other valued function buttons are also displayed on the keyboard to help your daily work. After you get a frame of image you want, you could add your comment and press the annotation button to activate annotation input or to select from the annotation library. You could also select the right application to fit your needs. Press the body mark button and choose the right one. Switch the body mark button to change the angle of transducer marker and move the trackball to put the transducer marker to the right place. Here comes the caliper and calculation part. If you choose caliper to do some basic measure, the list will appear to left hand side. Click the measure you need. The mark will appear in the image area. Set the point and follow next step by set key. The result will appear when you finish whole steps. If you want to go further measurements, press calc button. More comprehensive measure list will display. You could choose different application. We cover abdominal, urology, small part, gynecology, abstractic, vascular, cardiac, and pediatric to face different professional examination. All these calculation results will go to report automatically when you finish the calculation. After you get a perfect frame in Cine, or you finish all of annotation, body mark, and calculation work, you could press Cine or Image button directly. The image in Cine will be saved in the clickboard. You could use Pointer to choose the image to review and manage them. By clicking these function items when you finish all exam scanning, press Report to review calculation results. Give comments by summary. Choose image to attach in the report. Preview your report if you finish all workload above, then send them by DICOM or end exam if you only want to save them locally. By pressing the setup button in the lower left corner of the keyboard, you will go into the settings interface. There are different buttons on the left side of the interface to show you how many items you can set up. Firstly, it is about the general settings. There are four pages in the item, including general, display, save, and biopsy. On general page is all about the general settings, including hospital names, language, time, etc. On display page, you can change the display things according to the customer's preference. The save page is more commonly used because on this page, you can change the storage time and also the key functions of P1, P2, F3, and F4. The Cine can be changed in this page as well. The biopsy things, including biopsy guideline and biopsy grid, lies on the page of biopsy. Secondly, let's go to the exam preset items. You need to choose the probe you want to change in the preset. The preset shows on the probe interface are lying on the selected items column. They can be rearranged by the arrows and the buttons on the bottom right. And you can also add the exam presets in the selected items. There are two pages under the comment items, tools and list. On the tools page, you can customize the annotation elements. On the list page, the commonly used comments in different applications are listed. You can also add your own ones to the list as well. The body mark item is similar to the comment item. It lists the available body marks in different applications and you choose those you need. 
there are three pages under measure item. On the general page, it's all about the universal settings of the measurement elements. You can also change the result position. On the application page, you can make the specific changes in different applications. For example, in OB application, you can choose different estimation for the EFW calculation. On the list page, the callout menus of the caliber and calc under different application are adjustable. Adding measurement is also available on this page. Under report item, the elements on the report are adjustable. Hospital logo importing is available, but the format and the resolution should strictly follow the instruction. All the adjustments made in this page will be shown directly on the report. There are two pages in peripheral items. Basic pages for the settings of video output, a video output printer, and foot switch. Network page is for the internet connection. DICOM settings, including service and local settings, are lying on DICOM item. You can add, edit, delete, ping, and verify DICOM service on the DICOM service page. Local device and storage settings are on the local setting page. The user manual is available in help item. You can load the default settings on the load page of load default item. Present settings can be saved as a given name on new page. Importing and exporting settings are also available. User management is available in user security item to make sure that the system is not used by unidentified users. The about item shows the system information which is quite important for troubleshooting. After making any changes, pressing the apply button is necessary to make the settings to take effect. Press the power button. The shutdown window will appear on the screen. Choose standby. It will go to standby mode and it will boot up in several seconds. Next time you press the power button to turn it on, choose shut down. It will shut down immediately. Cancel is used to cancel the shutdown procedure.